Hey everyone, it's Fine Putty here. Welcome back to another video. Today I am in Glasgow, and you also might notice that this is a voiceover because I'm also recording this video on a new camera. It looks very nice, but I forgot to set up the audio for the first part of this video. So it's just this. So I'm going to do the best I can to try and recreate what I said in the intro. In this video, I am in Glasgow and I am going on the Glasgow subway. It's a very complex system. Luckily, I've got a little graphic on screen for you here. Yep, it's literally just a circle with about 15 stations. But I really wanted to visit this system because it's my channel colours. It is orange and grey, so it could not be more perfect. I'm starting at the station Cessnock, and I'm just going to be travelling around to different stations and exploring the system to see what it has to offer. Walking, 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 walking. Wow! It was at this point that I realised the orange line was the outer circle, and the grey line was the inner circle. The orange line going clockwise, and the grey line going anti-clockwise. So I decided to take the grey line into more central Glasgow first. <laughs> this is the brakes of the train. <laughs> wow, the train, the train's here, it's orange and grey, wow, wow. <laughs> That's the doors closing. Okay, the audio starts now. Alright, now I'm trying out the tiny mic as well. I don't know if this is going to work. I really am unsure of the audio quality of this video. It might turn out to be horrible. I'm at West Street. There we go. Um, I am just going to continue going in the, the grey direction, I think, for the entire video. But I'm going to get out here, because the inner next arrival is in seven minutes. So I may as well have a look around. I bought an all-day ticket, only £4. Pretty nice. So I may as well use it, have a look at the system, see what it has to offer. Alright, and because... I think Bridge Street is quite close to here. I'm literally just going to walk to Bridge Street, uh, which is the next station along. I think once I'm done with this, I'm going to go on the orange line and then go all the way around and time how long it takes. I think it's something like half an hour, maybe. I don't know if you can tell from my accent, but I am actually a quarter Scottish. My, my family, my ancestors, they are from Glasgow. This is where I'm from. This is my quarter Scottish. How fun is that? I am realizing that the tiny mic is great for when I'm in my house, but um, I probably should invest in a shotgun mic if I want to continue filming outside with my camera like this. I think walking was a bit of a mistake because I'm now missing the one that was in seven minutes. So I now might have to wait seven minutes anyway at this station. But at least I got to see a lovely part of Glasgow. White moment. The station is right here. Five minutes. One of the reasons I've gotten off here at Cal Cadden's is because this is where one of my one of my favourite videos on the entire internet takes place. And it's, it's the announcement, mind the gap between the train and the platform. And there is a comment on this video that says, there is a gap between me and my wife. It's ridiculous and I love it. And it's so funny to me. And I'm actually here where it happened. I've got about five minutes until my train. Ooh. It's green. It's an energy saving escalator. I also picked a really nice day to film this video on. Is there a thing that says 
cow cannon. I mean, kind of. That's the closest I'll get. Okay, train carriage all to myself. I really like the trains, they're really nice. I love the orange handlebars. I love everything about the color, cool. I love everything about the colors, obviously. I am on my way to Partick, not Patrick. This is, this is Partick. This is not Patrick, it's Partick. <laughs> And I've made it to Ibrox. I've been to all of the stations on the Glasgow subway now. I am now going to go over to that platform over there. Let's, wow. Gonna go over to that platform, then take the orange line all the way um, around back to Cessnock. Oh crap, it's here, okay. I might miss this train actually. suggest two minutes on top of that to do a full loop so it's about 23 minutes in total to go all the way around from Ibrox to Ibrox. I'm not done just yet there's still time left in the video look, look down there there's time left in the video I'm gonna I didn't really get to explore um, this section oh I can zoom in whoa so I'm gonna go to a few stations along here just have a look around because I only really went on this side <laughs> Okay, and I'm here at Patrick, I mean Partick. I am gonna go up, have a look around. Oh, it's actually quite nice, wow. Look at that, that's really quite cool. And the escalators, are... look at that, that's amazing. I love the orange lights. But yeah, I'm gonna go up here, have a look around. Uh, there's another train in six minutes. I'll go for another one. I'll go for Kelvin Bridge maybe. Oh wow, this station's actually quite big. Oh, uh, because it's a national rail station or a Scott Rail station as well. That's quite cool. Another thing I really like is the, I don't know how it works, but this paper ticket is also contactless. And it's crazy. That's so cool. A contactless paper card. Go back down, go to Kelvin Bridge then I, sh I will be done. Oh my god, it's the green train I saw earlier. No way. 
That's absolutely incredible. Okay, Kelvin Bridge. Also, I don't want to brag or anything, but I did um, call that I was going to get the green train. Not, not going to lie, I didn't show it in the video, but I did call it. Put that clip in now. I was just thinking about this. I reckon I've got a really good chance of catching up with the green train that I saw earlier. There's a chance that I could, this next train could be the green train that I saw earlier. That'd be quite cool. If it isn't, cut this bit out. And if it is, cut this bit out, because then that'd be a cool surprise. Cut this bit out. All right, I've got three minutes until the outer train, the orange train, and yeah. That was pretty much my journey on the Glasgow subway. Still can't get over the fact that these are my colors. It's great. Okay, and I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, that is absolutely fantastic. I very much enjoyed the Glasgow subway and it was a lot of fun to explore and have a look around. Wow, I am really white. If you haven't seen my channel before, be sure to subscribe because I make a bunch of videos like these. I, I, love, I love trains and going on trains and exploring trains. Uh, <laughs> I hope you liked this new camera. The quality is amazing. I really like it a lot, but I really hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, that's great. Be sure to subscribe, like, all of that stuff, and I will see you in the next one, depending on what it is. Bye-bye.